In this video, we're going to take you through a full beginner's guide to Zoomex, showing you how to create an account, deposit, trade, open and close positions, and then finally how to withdraw from Zoomex. Plus stick around to the end of the video where we're going to take you through Zoomex's campaign, where as part of the World Series of Trading Competition, there's up to 2,400,000 USDT up for grabs with Zoomex. For more information on Zoomex, please check out everybithelps.io. First up, a little bit about Zoomex. So Zoomex Exchange established in 2021 in Singapore, and it's a cryptocurrency trading platform where users can trade USDT perpetual and inverse perpetual contract trading. They also support over 50 types of altcoin trading pairs including USDT and BTC. If you're brand new to the world of crypto, you can buy Bitcoin or USDT directly from within Zoomix. Or for those that are more experienced, you can also trade up to 100x leverage margin to maximize on your profits and adjust the leverage depending on your preferences. Zoomix is available as a mobile app on iOS or Android, or as a web platform. But for the purposes of this tutorial today, I'm going to be taking you through the web platform. To sign up for Zoomex, head across to zoomex.com or use my link in the summary, then sign up or create an account. At which point you're going to be prompted to create an account with a mobile number or email address. You'll then need to create a strong secure password and enter a referral code which I'll link below. Then agree to the terms of service and click on to sign up. Then once you're signed up, the first thing that we'd recommend doing before you go ahead and start funding your account is to secure it. So if we head across to our profile icon in the top right and then choose account and security and two factor authentication. Here is where you can set up phone verification or Google Authenticator, which will provide you with one time codes for actions such as logging into your account. Also, the account and security section is where you'll find the KYC verification section. To start using Zoomex, you don't need to go through any KYC. However, if you want to increase your basic verification and therefore your withdrawal amounts, you can provide your nationality, name, ID and face verification. Then once you've secured your account, let's take a look at depositing funds into it. With Zoomex, you can only deposit crypto. Therefore, you can't deposit fiat if you don't already have any crypto. They do also have the option to buy crypto from their site through a third party called Paxful. Now, this is a video for another day, but you can buy with the likes of euros or US dollars, and in return, you can purchase USDT or Bitcoin. Now, this isn't the cheapest way to buy your crypto as you are dictated to by the rate, and fees obviously apply here, but it can be a convenient way to access crypto if you don't already have any to deposit. However, if you do have crypto, let's see how we can deposit it. If we click onto Assets in the top right, you'll then reach the Assets page, showing you an overview of your balance and a breakdown by derivatives, position margin, order cost and unrealized P&L. You then have all the supported cryptocurrencies with their individual balance if you have any. Then quick links for exchange, deposit and withdrawal. If we choose Deposit against USDT now, here is where you'll find your wallet address for this specific crypto, and you can either scan the QR code or you can copy the deposit address from here. An important part of this is also choosing the correct chain type, as with some cryptos or coins, and in this case USDT, there are a few chains supported, and it's essential to select the correct one for the chain that you're sending your crypto from. In the world of crypto, transactions are non-retractable. Therefore, it's worth sending across smaller test amounts first if you are feeling nervous. Then once you've sent across your crypto and the transaction has been confirmed, it will appear under your asset balance. Plus from here is where you can also exchange your coins directly on Zoomex for any of the other four cryptocurrencies available on the platform, which are Bitcoin, Ethereum, EOS, XRP and USDT. And there are no fees for asset exchanges. However, just know that there are some minimum and maximum limits. So now that we have some crypto deposited, let's take a look at the markets so that we can take a look at what we can trade with Zoomex. And there are two different markets available, which are inverse perpetual and USDT perpetual. 
USDT Perpetual is where the margin that's used is USDT. Whereas with an inverse contract, you can trade a Bitcoin, Ethereum, XRP, EOS contract and the underlying cryptocurrency will be used as the margin to trade with. With inverse, you have Bitcoin, ETH, EOS and XRP. Whereas USDT Perpetual has a lot more trading options. Let's take a look at the trading pair BTC USDT, and when we click onto it, the trading screen will then appear. So let's take a look around the screen first before we start opening positions. First, you'll see the trading pair that you've selected from the market screen, which you can change by clicking on the drop down here. You then have the current price, mark, and index prices, funding rate, 24 hour change, high, low, and turnover. Plus you could also switch from light to dark mode if you prefer. You then have your charts underneath which you can select for specific periods of time. There's the order book here with potential sell orders in red and buys in green as well as recent trades underneath. Any order information will display underneath your positions, close P&L, active orders and order history. Then over on the right hand side of the screen you then have where you can open and close your positions. To open a position, first you'll need to ensure that you're on the Open tab at the top of this section. Then choose between Cross Margin Mode or Isolated Margin Mode. If we click onto where it says Cross now, the Margin Mode will then appear. And this is where you can also adjust your leverage. Just be aware though here that if you do adjust this, the leverage will affect all the positions and any active orders under that current pair. You then have your order types. And from here, you can select from market, limit, or a conditional order type. A market order will execute immediately at the current market price, whereas a limit allows you to find the price you'd like to buy or sell at, and a conditional order will only activate once a trigger price has been met. If you choose market, enter in the amount that you'd like to buy in BTC in this case, and then you can also set your long or buy take profit or set loss parameters. Finally, then choose to open your position. And your open order will then appear under your positions. If you want to close your position, this is what I'm going to show you next. So to close a position, first you'll need to select the close tab from the top of the screen. Then enter in the amount for the market order or price and the amount if it's a limit order. Then finally, select the position to be closed from either buy or sell. Then finally, let's take a look at how you can withdraw your crypto from Zumex. If we head back to our assets and choose to withdraw from the top of the screen or beside the coin or asset you'd like to withdraw, then select the currency from the list if it's not already set and choose the network you're sending your crypto on. Then you'll need to ensure that the platform or the wallet that you're sending your crypto to supports this network. To withdraw to an address, you'll first need to add it to your list of addresses by entering an address name, currency network, and here is where you can paste in your address. Then once this has been submitted, it will be available from the address drop down. And you can then enter in the amount that you'd like to withdraw or you can withdraw all and any minimum amounts and fees will also be displayed and your withdrawal limit. Now that does complete how you can trade with Zumex. But there is a lot more to Zumex than some of the basics that I've covered today. For example, Zumex is currently running a campaign as part of the World Series of Trading Competition. The prize pool consists of rewards for both teams and individuals. Team participants will benefit from up to 3,600,000 USDT, and there's up to 2,400,000 USDT available for grasp in the individual competition. The event will last for 20 days, beginning on the 27th of June and running until the 7th of July 2022. And WSOT, or World Series of Trading, ranks contestants by the profit versus loss percentage, where traders compete on a level playing field regardless of the depth of their pockets. And there's also two bonus opportunities. Firstly, there's an early bird prize of $60, and new and existing users can participate as long as users who successfully register between the 10th and the 12th of June at 10 UTC and also meet the requirements in terms of transaction volume and mobile email authentication, they can get a $60 bonus. 
and if existing users miss the early bird, there's no registration bonus. Only new users will get the $30 bonus. And secondly, the top 10 registered users of the team will get an additional $20 bonus. But that completes our tutorial. And I hope you enjoyed this video today. And if you did, then please give me a like, hit the subscribe button, and please do head over to our website at everybithelps.io for more tips, reviews, and step-by-step -step guides. Thanks, and I'll see you soon.